Hi, I'm in the middle of Gemetaios National Park, which is in the heart of rural Lithuania. And it might look and smell beautiful, the scent of the pine trees is wonderful, but deep within this forest lies a big secret. This used to be owned by Russia, and this is where Russia built a nuclear missile base. Let's go and take a look. This gun, Kalashnikov, uh, was used uh, with, for soldiers who were outside and had to walk around the old complex. And these small... So here I am at the entrance to the Cold War Museum. It's spooky to see the watchtower up there. And over here is all this barbed wire. I've been told that it's very cold inside there, so I brought a cardigan with me. Um, Cold War in name and apparently Cold War in reality. The museum, it's under the ground, about eight meters. Uh, we're gonna go through there and come back from this uh, side because, well, uh, we're gonna visit the Sile and come through here. Yeah. <laughs> okay, thank you. So, yeah, here we, we go. Uh, be careful with the head. Oh, I can see it's a low entrance there. Luckily, I'm short. <laughs> <laughs> I'm on what? Oh, I didn't need to duck though. I see what you mean. You do actually need to be careful. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, it's getting darker now. We can enter. I'm about to enter the control room from where the nuclear bomb could be fired off. It's chilling stuff. This here is the key that you can start the whole process of firing off the nuclear bomb. Points. It's a one dollar, one ruble uh, coins uh, launch key. Uh, and, and apparently the bombs were a hundred times stronger than the ones used in Hiroshima and Nagasaki. Going down, down, no, down, Americans eight had, meters. Yeah, Americans had a, a lot of islands, so that's uh, there where they could crack. God, these were the masks they made to prepare just in case a bomb was set off. So here's a mask, I'm gonna try it on. That is really hard to breathe when you're wearing it. <laughs> oh my god. Oh god. That's not easy. Oh my god. Look at this shaft down there. Oh, it's huge. Oh god, I never knew I thought I knew so much about nuclear weapons, but here now I've got a better understanding. We were just underneath that thing there. And that's where the nuclear bomb would have been fired up from. Unbelievable. Thank goodness the Cold War finished amicably is all I can say. Anyway, I hope you've enjoyed my review video. If you have, please give me a thumbs up. Happy traveling and please subscribe to my channel.